Hello, today in this quick bite series, I'm going to talk to you about uh, product thinking and how a large number of companies are actually moving towards a product thinking uh, mindset. Was uh, project based or process based thinking. So now that has shifted to product based thinking. So what actually is product based thinking? Uh, so the University of California, Berkeley actually has, uh, you know, scrapped the project management discipline from their courses and replaced it with lean and product management kind of practices, keeping in line uh, with the things that are changing in the industry. So if you look at uh, product based mindset, uh, so what really uh, how is that different from the previous uh, you know, uh, world uh, for the project based mindset? So projects were based on time schedules and scope. So it is all based on that iron triangle, uh, which they call they call it the iron triangle for a reason. Because it's iron because you can't change things around. The scope is fixed and then you can only move uh, the time and the resources uh, to achieve arrive at uh, certain features and things like that but now the whole triangle is inverted and then you arrive at a scope um, you know working on your time and uh, cost uh, and arrive at the scope so the as they call it emergent design or emergent architecture as you keep going so that is how uh, things have been changing yeah, because if you see facebook was not the first social media app there was my face there was friendster there was zorkut and a host of other things which uh, try to you know make uh, social connectivity better and for uh, facebook just made the whole experience a lot better and uh, they kind of uh, you know own the space uh, pretty much uh, based on based on superior user experience and ease of use and all of that uh, put together so your product my uh, thinking is uh, uh, not just features or output it's about outcome or value that you are adding to your customers so that is the fundamental difference that needs to be looked at from a project mindset or a process mindset when you step into a product mindset so how much of value are you adding to your customers how, what is the business outcome of what you have done uh, so that is uh, typically uh, what is uh, to be looked at and uh, uh, also the fact that you know you're going to be measuring uh, all of these things based on how the customer is able to get a job done uh, and what is the ease in which he can get his job uh, done uh, as opposed to just pushing features uh, on to customers and not knowing how they are going to interact with it or use it so it's like a sweet spot between uh, the usability the customer experience and uh, uh, you know product market viability so all of these things uh, play a huge role uh, in uh, understanding how the product mindset helps you to create superior products and products that will actually you know work in the long run uh, so if you are looking at uh, let us say you want to roll out a learning management system to your student uh, to your in your company and hr is involved so they be, uh, you instead of just rolling out out and providing lms support to all their people you would uh, now say that you know what is the kind of outcome those people are able to achieve based on the lms that you've provided so are they able to incorporate it in their jobs so how are they able to make it job relevant how much of it they really has gone into application in their jobs and things like that so your project mindset uh, is uh, uh, you know allowing you to do all of those things so that's a fundamental shift uh, between uh, project uh, thinking and uh, product based thinking a lot of large companies are going towards um, product mindset uh, thinking and uh, there is a lot of uh, literature on uh, the differences between project and product based uh, schedules so here it, the earlier thing was more on cost and time and scope was fixed now scope is variable and then cost and time is uh, 
um, uh, scope is variable cost and time can be adjusted uh, you know it could be uh, adjusted to arrive at a scope so the whole uh, thing gets inverted so there are a lot of those fundamental paradigm shifts that are happening uh, within the industry uh, and it's quite important to think in terms of products and uh, not really in terms of uh, projects and uh, so on so there is a huge amount of uh, thing uh, that is uh, gone uh, under uh, this umbrella uh, so uh, keeping it in the quick bite series i think this is just a quick uh, capsule like <coughs> condensed form of what is there in that body of knowledge and why it makes sense for companies to adopt product based uh, thinking so i'll link up a few companies who are actually already doing that um, kind of stuff including um, the likes of um, uh, you know amazon and um, google and um, mercedes benz and bmw and so on uh, so stay tuned uh, for more such updates uh, and uh, do like share and subscribe this video thank you very much